Early on in the pandemic, we met a suburban frontline couple after they both got COVID-19. This morning, we check in with them again for a story of hope for a brighter future. Now they got more pillows and blankets than we do, so. Chief, <laughs> Rocky, and Scruffy sense a big change is coming. With a month to go, Gunner and Taylor Herman are expecting their first baby, a boy. She set the, the pregnancy test in front of me and I, I thought I was going to pass out. Taylor, a nurse, and Gunner, a volunteer firefighter, have had one really tough year. It was also kind of like nerve-wracking in a way just because this is not this whole year with like politics and pandemic and everything it was like what kind of world am I bringing my baby into kind of thing. They both witnessed the heart-wrenching pain of losing patients to COVID and fought the virus themselves 11 months ago. We are both just now fully recovering our sense of smell and taste. Um, mm -hmm. I'm able to, I wasn't able to get anywhere near peanut butter. They say they were blessed to only suffer milder symptoms. And if all that wasn't enough, one of their three rescues was diagnosed with cancer, needing really costly treatments. We love him to death. And I mean, he's a, a he's our smelly beagle. We can get him. We just want another summer with him. Yeah, we just want him to meet his, his, his baby. Rocky is now in remission, and as the couple prepares for their little boy's arrival, they are surrounded by friends and family support, which include a COVID-safe drive-by baby shower. Everybody was so positive and so uplifting and being like, you know, no matter what happened this year, there's something good that came out of it. Taylor tells us she did get the vaccine while pregnant and hopes those that can get it will. We do want to thank Taylor and Gunner for all they're doing. And of course, we wish them the best.